You are listening to Radio Turkide and we've got big news. Our special, special guests are here now and we'll be announcing them just after this. Hello! Hi, yeah! How are you? I'm alright. You alright then? Hello. Nice to meet you, mate. Oh! Got you then? You okay? Yeah, nice to see you. This is nice and cosy. Graham Kelly. Michael, nice to meet you finally. How are you? Yes, She's How fantastic. How are you doing? You're right. Yeah. Um, it's a river. I don't know. I want to touch you. Oh, hey, you're good. Hi, Anne. Oh, hi, Anne. Big announcement now. We've been teasing everybody so far. <laughs> <laughs> we got Mike too. We should be headphones. Okay. Don't need headphones. So we've got a couple of messages saying, um, who is it? Who is it? Well, if they watch Facebook, well, they know because they're putting it on Facebook. How many people are you looking for? Um, I only know the weekly figures, which is quarter of a million. So that's fantastic. We've got messages from Florida this morning already. So. That's amazing. Sorry. Just from this little border cabin at the back of the community hey. centre. Is it one? Well, there's two border cabins. There's one next door as well. All right. Okay. okay. That's equipment. You've so. extended. So we're gonna we're gonna settle uh, Sean into the studio right now and start off with this one, which I think is pretty apt, to be honest. <laughs> Did you have any music you wanted to play? Yeah. You've got a massive amount of music. <laughs> top, top five are from six to one to six. And then, and then anything else that takes your fancy on there. I think. Right back, Dr. Meeker, which is track number 15. Whatever you want, you tell me what to play now, player. Okay, track number 15, right back, sir. Uh, Boy in the picture, number 6. Should I just put a little mark for that? Which track would you go for? I'll pop over and see you playing. I was going down, I think I'm going down the cold. Don't breathe in I want to put a track on one of your um, albums next year. Well, yeah, we got the next one's out in the spring. We're doing a Welsh Connections Christmas next year as well. Great. Christmas songs. Nice. We've got loads. Just, we don't want charity yet. Yeah. Because uh, that one's for uh, the all new Welsh number. We raised about 500, well, another one show, we raised about 500. Um, and I think we're on track for about 1,000. So. Yeah. Hi there, I'm Sarah Passmore and you are listening to the fabulous Michael Kennedy on Radio Tinkoid. Enjoy the show. Yeah, I'm just hoping it after. Is that right? That's really smooth. Everyone's gone quiet, nobody's messaging. They're listening. Apart from that, I think the cats are smooth. All these messages come from Florida and all over the place. And then my wife said to me, did you feed the cat this morning? <laughs> Exclusive play of the Boy in the Picture by Sean Evans here on Radio Tier Clyde 106.5 FM. Tell us all about it. Ah, it's a, it's a, it just was a lovely session with a guy called um, Nico, or Kid Queen he's known as, in uh, Belgium. And I arrived in his studio, in inverted commas, it, it's a, a massive house. And it's a bit, it's a bit like, it was like the young ones kind of house, you know, massive mansion, just full of um, um, amazing musicians, got four studios in it, but it, it just felt really creative as soon as I got there and um, started writing and this just fell, fell together. It was kind of a, the, the song was, is, is about not neglecting your child within who you are, you know, no matter how you change throughout your life. You're still that child still in there and still to respond to that um, that in a in a child I suppose. Do, do you still love? I mean, that's a silly question. I see that I see the light in your eyes. But do you still love making the music? Oh, it's my lifeline. It's it's who I am really. Um, if I'm not writing, if I'm not making music, then you know I, I don't. I feel unnecessary and I, I 
find myself getting into trouble then. <laughs> <laughs> I remember the first time I interviewed you with those stories. Uh, you just come back from a, a big, pretty big tour as well, haven't you? I've been working. I, I'm always, I'm always working. I'm always um, in Russia or the Ukraine. Um, I've got a, a big following there, so it's it's great to go up there. I've also started working with a producer called um, Artu. I, I call him Ditu, <laughs> but his name is Arthur, and. Um, and he's, we've really connected, so I'm going back out there now in January to put some more tracks together and hopefully release an EP with him. Oh, so I'm, I'm keeping, since since the demise of Kusheen, you know, I'm, I've am i kind of, it was uh, a horrible split. It wasn't very pleasant, um, heartbreaking in a lot of ways. But since then, I've just thrown my energy out as, into as many corners as I possibly can to, to see who I, I really am and to see who I'm, I'm going to connect with and, and write music with and it's turned out some really really interesting stuff some great sounds and you can you can still hear I think from all of the songs that that element that my element is is definitely there in developing so it's it's good the future's bright well I know we've got some more great tracks to play from you a little bit loads and, I just don't know which ones to pick oh, really. we'll play as we can because I love okay. you, know, you know I love the music so medley um, yeah, <laughs> yeah and if uh, and if you've got any questions for Sean give us a ring 01792 Eight nine eight six two eight. Yeah, come on. Brilliant. What should I play next? Which one of yours? Um, I think we'll play Talk to Me, which is track ten. Oh, there's a way to bit. Make it ten. you say to me, see it in the way we are, sometimes I wish that you could talk to me, and take me to your heart, you know it's so not just a memory, I wanna pull it back, sometimes I wish that you would talk to me. Each and every night until the morning light. And if you open up for me just one more time, I'll show you something fine. I wanna make it right in every way. To something really special today. No, have you got Sean, Sean Evans, the Sean Evans in the studio? <laughs> we're uh, we get some exclusive plays these fantastic tracks. Yeah. So, what's the plan with them? Ah, that's that's it. I mean, I have been compiling an album for the last two years, um, drawing from all of the collaborations that I've had in those in those years, and putting them together. And I'm, it's got to be absolutely perfect. You know, for me to put an album out as myself, after everything that I've done, all the accolade yeah, that I've already, yeah. you know, with louder and with well, you've, you've made that benchmark, haven't you? you, you... It's got to be right. Yeah. It's got to be perfect. <laughs> and so that's why I'm kind of not dragging my heels. I'm just really kind of picking the best of the best. Um, that particular track was with this uh, Fugu track, which absolutely wonderful producer in Brighton called P, uh, Dino Sparrows and we, we've we written some great music together I'd like to include his music in the album um, there is a flavour you know I, I've worked with some incredible people and, and quite a diverse amount you know diverse yeah. bunch of people but there seems to be a thread that goes through the, all of the music which ties it all together which, if you listen to them back to back you can hear it and I, yeah, I'm pleased with that that if I can bring that onto the album then I'll be happy. I've been working with a band. Uh, initially when I left, when I didn't leave, Kusheen, Kusheen folded pretty much and uh, I started as a reaction to the electronica that I've been working with for such a long time. I put an acoustic band together and it was going to be an acoustic band to, to perform the songs that I've written with Kusheen and for Kusheen and plugged. And it, they really worked, you know, take the electronic backup away, you take all of the sub-basses away and the machines away and you just put the song with the guitar 
I suppose that's the test of a good song, yeah, to yeah. see it stand there alone. And that, that was lovely, but um, it was very difficult to promote because obviously my legacy is electronic music. But um, the band that I put together then with Ron McElroy, who is a friend of mine and, and a musician that I've been writing with for over 25 years, um, it seemed natural to kind of take it to the next level and maybe plug in the guitars and maybe start to add some backing tracks and, and placate that kind of more edgy side of, of my songwriting. So uh, I'm, I'm going to play you a... I'd like to play you Sunshine, if that's, if that's OK. That's track four which gives you an example of, of where we're going with, with, the, uh, with the new material. It's not mixed, it's, it's as raw as you like, but I thought I'd trust you to play it and to, to give your opinion of it, so. <laughs> Kelly was like, we're going to to co-ed. <laughs> I got, I was stopped once when I was in Cardiff by somebody driving around, pointing the window down. Excuse me, could you tell me where Eastrad Menach is? <laughs> oh, <I> said Menach. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Send a pound or two or however much we can afford to Radio Tiakoid, Tiakoid Boris Village, Tiakoid Swansea. I should have brought the pound, I think, didn't I? <laughs> oh, God, Alan. No, no, it's not Christmas. But I, just wanted to, I just had to play it. Was, I've got to be the first one to get the Christmas things Ding in. dong. I've decided. Yeah, why not? Although uh, we are here on Christmas Day, me and, uh, me and Keith, who's filming today. Uh, I'm doing a Christmas show between 12 and 2, and uh, I'll be playing all the Christmas classics, and Keith will be playing some European stuff that he's chosen especially for the day. Apparently this one from Inge from Sweden. Sweden? Possibly. Anyway, you're listening to Radio Chirikai. Welcome back. It is just gone 9 o'clock. I'm here with um, the wonderful Sean Evans, oh, yeah. Kelly Hardy, Yay. Keith Evans, and Helen Bannon. Who is remaining remarkably quiet in the background, because she writes we're not going to get her on the microphone. <laughs> That's what she says. There's not a lot of chance of anyone else getting the mic with uh, me and you in here, is there? No, not really. <laughs> no. <laughs> to, to, for promoters to get their heads around, because obviously, with where I've come from, electronic music yeah. and dance music, they couldn't quite put two and six together. And my my fan base now are, are you know, the multi age groups. You know, I've got people in their forties that just love the music and love the songwriting. Um, but also, you know, I go to to Russia and there there are like twenty year olds in the audience, which is fantastic. But it, I think that. I enjoyed it. I, it was a, a plaster for me on the cut of, of breaking with Kusheen. But um, I guess I like to see people getting up and dancing. So I've, I've changed the set now. The set for the 8th of December in, in the Globe in Cardiff. It's kind of, it crosses all of those kind of boundaries. We, we're going to start the set quite um, acoustic and um, you know, the, like the song that you heard, yeah. Sunshine. And then as we build up, we're going to get more and more electronic as the set goes through. So it's going to kind of tick all the boxes, really. Well, that's going to be a great game. That's December the 8th? December the 8th in, in the Globe in Cardiff. Oh, it's yeah. a lovely venue as well. It's a great venue. It's nice. It's an intimate venue. We're very close to selling it. So I'd urge people, if they want to come, to be quick off the mark and get their tickets in. Um, it's, a small, it's a small venue. But I, I like that intimacy. And it's nice to kind of test the water, especially on my, my Cardiff family. You know, my, I'm, I've come home to Cardiff. Yeah, you're back I've in moved Cardiff, back in right? Cardiff, yeah. Which is great. It's lovely. And you've got some up and, up and coming lads supporting you the other night. I have, yeah. We've got the Future Dub Orchestra, who are amazing. I mean, I'm, yeah, I'm, I, they're going to be a hard act for me to follow, actually. They're brilliant. They're so together. And play uh, some fabulous dub and dub, drum and bass. And then we've got my lovely Ragsy. <laughs> Little Aberdeer boy. Little Aberdeer boy, yeah, he's fab. He's lovely. I, I wrote a song with him, actually. I don't know whether you've heard it, The Morning Sun. Oh, would you like, yeah, would you yeah. Like, yeah. Would you play that, yeah, if you like? Yeah, I've got that on the CD I've yeah, with me. To. I'm very proud of it. I'm super proud of him. He's such a, an emotive 
writer. Um, yeah, and so yeah, so I've asked him to come along, and he's he's pleased to come and support me. So. Yep. Oh, that'll be a great night. It's going to be a fabulous night, yes. Okay, stick with us. This is the 100 hour live marathon at Radio Cheer Five on 6.5 FM, and you're listening to, well, me and the wonderful Sean Evans. Me and you, babe. So, what are we doing next? We've, we've, I mean, I'm really excited about the gig. I want to play everything to you, but th there's a songwriter that I was writing with in Cardiff called Simon Kingman, and we put together a beautiful project called Mellow Park, M-E-L-O-P-A-R-K. You can still find it on the, on the internet, but we never released it. It's like one of those things, you know, you write it, you put it together, and then our lives took us away from the project, and it never was actually, there was no resolution. But this is a lovely track. It's called Never Wanted, and yeah, see what you think. It's acoustic. <laughs> <laughs> she looks like something from Lord of the Rings. <laughs> Is she in here now? <laughs> oh, I'm not saying I'm absolutely loving this. Did you tracks. like that? I think that's fantastic. It's quite eclectic, the little bunch of songs I've brought you, isn't it? Yeah. So, yeah, lovely, thank you. So, yeah. when, I mean, it's one about, you know, you've got plans to get the album out there. Mm -hmm. And it's got, we know it's got to be right because you are a mm -hmm. perfectionist, but. Mm -hmm. When can we expect that to hit our, hit our record shops? I, I want an EP, at the very least, to be released by um, March next year. There you are, here are your first. Yeah. March so 2018. I have a focus. Yeah, brilliant. Um, I'm in a new place. I've got, you know, I can, I can focus. I can really use the winter as a kind of gestation period to gather everything, galvanise everything, um, and to do some more recording, actually. Because, you know, we're writing all the time. So the set at the moment for the 8th in, in the Globe is a kind of a mixture of Cushing covers and my own new work with Ron McElroy and with other artists. But the more songs we're writing, the less Cushing songs we're playing. I know the audience at the moment still want to hear Cushing and, and I still want to sing Cushing songs. But I think I'm going to be... But because the quality of those tracks that we're writing now is be is becoming stronger and stronger, and there's less need for the covers, yeah, if you know, yeah, yeah. for the for the versions of the Cushing songs. So yeah, let's see, let's see what we can what we can gather during the winter. Because it for musicians, the winter is always that. You your know, down, your downtime. it's well, the downtime. Time, it's, but... it's work. Yeah. It's work time. You know, touring is from the autumn. And then the festivals in the summer, but the winter is for. We've seen some creating. fantastic um, photographs of you on, on social media, yeah. playing to crowds of thousands. I know, I know, I know. I, 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 I can pull a crowd like that in in Russia, in Poland, in the Czech Republic, in uh, Ukraine, Kiev. Um, I need to to focus on the UK a little bit more. I think it was always a um, a, a, a project for Kushin to go where the records were selling the strongest and, and that was Europe and I think that we neglected the UK a little yeah. bit but I, I know there's love for what I do here and there I'm, I'm going to yeah. work on that yeah so if people want to check you on, on social media or, or websites how, how do they get in touch with you well they can um, get me Sean Evans UK is my Twitter and my Instagram and my Facebook account and then Sean um, hyphen Evans dot com is my website and you can reach me, Kelly, Maria, and they're my girls, and, and we'll do our best to answer any questions and to keep you posted. I know you've got a, you've got a great Kelly show with us, so you've got a fantastic team with you now, haven't you? I have, yeah, I have. And there's a lot of love. It's a passionate kind of involvement. The girls really pick me up when, when I kind of fell down after... Do, do they keep you in line me. as well? Oh, God, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Kelly shaking her head. Uh, yes, they do. They do. They do, actually. They do. And they're both really kind of diminutive, kind of statured women, but my God, they, they pack a punch. She looks tough. She's tough. I wouldn't want to argue with No, her. I wouldn't. I don't. And, and Maria as well, my Russian uh, lady, she's, she says, hear me roar. <laughs> she's strong. And I'm, you know, I'm kind of, I'm such a, a you know, I, I love, I love everything. I love people are, and I'm very I'm too soft sometimes and I need a bit of backbone and I certainly do have backbone now that he's too. <laughs> the 18, should we call them the 18? Are they, are they in the 18? <laughs> they are. They are. <laughs> Kelly looks like half the 18. She is. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, 
uh, is this kind of stuff we can expect on the eighth? Absolutely, the yeah, absolutely. We're going to take it. Um, like we like kids in a sweet shop. We've got so much to choose from. But I've uh, designed the set to be nice and fluid and strong and kind of build up to a nice dancing finale. So. When you when you put the show together, yeah. You got you got a group of uh, musicians around yeah. you. How do you decide what you're going to start with, what you're going to finish with? Are those the big songs to start and the end? I guess uh, you know, being a songwriter is, a, is is a bit like being a cook. You know, you you have to have the balance. You've, you've got to use the right ingredients, not too much, not too sweet, not too sour. You know, not too salty, and just put it together like that. So I organically already think about where the tracks are going to go in the set to create a really nice balanced recipe. Um, so yeah, that, that, that's that's been that's my kind of going going to sleep thoughts for the last month. <laughs> I'm looking forward to this. It's going to come gonna, down. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm on now four to six. Brilliant. Um, but I'm going to jump straight in the car and come all the way down there. Awesome. Wouldn't miss Brilliant. you. Wouldn't miss you, right? Oh, can't be done. Thank you, and you'll love the future double orchestra as well. Oh, that's good. Uh, a friend of mine, Dead Crow, um, got up and rapped with them while they were in Swansea uh, last month, I think. Okay. And apparently, they're an amazing group of guys. They are. They're fantastic. Yeah, they are amazing. I played with them in Western Supermare at the festival there, and they invited me on the stage. They're very generous artists, and I, I think that Cardiff will love them. So that's the Globe, Friday, December the 8th. That's correct. Uh, 7.30? Yeah, yeah, get there, get there as early as you can because we've got a really packed um, schedule. So I don't want anyone to miss anything. Really. But get your tickets now because I know uh, that tickets are absolutely flying out for this gig. Mm. Uh, I think it's probably going to be the gig of the year. Oh, thank you. It's definitely going to be my gig of the year. <laughs> get down, get down the card for the Globe. Uh, fantastic venue to see Sean, Ragsy and the Future Dev Orchestra. <laughs> Yes, they do, don't they? That's my lovely Ragsy. Oh, I'll probably sing that one with him on the eighth ah, as well. That'd be great, that'd be yeah. Fantastic. <laughs> I, you know, I can remember Ragsy telling me um, in the old old studio, the last radio station yeah. uh, that we were at. Yeah. Um, I remember him telling me that he said he'd asked you to sing on that song, and you were so chuffed when you said yes. And what a result! I think what happened was that we were at a gig together, and and I just the harmony to it just dropped for me, and I, I heard it and started to sing it, and and we were like. This works. Yeah. Let's do it. Yeah. So to see the wonderful Shalemans and the wonderful Razzy together uh, Friday the 8th of December at the Globe in Cardiff. Brilliant. Get your tickets now. Awesome. Inspired rock today with this fantastic music. <laughs> that was a Danny Wheeler. That's Danny Wheeler. He's a, um, uh, a new artist who runs his own label in London. That's yet to come out. Um, I'm unsigned as well, which is, you know, it, it makes it harder to do it all yourself. But um, it also gives you freedom to be able to I was do whatever ask, yeah, you yeah, want to do, yeah. and I need that freedom. You know, I'm I'm kind of yeah. I, I like I like to be given my head, if you like. Well, we can't wait. We can't wait to hear the, the see the whole new package. It's well, gonna be out. great. Uh, oh, I've just I've got to give another shout out go to away. Rudy. Yeah. Go away, Rudy. Howl like a wolf. Oh, it's been worth it. It's been worth waking up at the crack of dawn <laughs> to get here and play some of these tunes that, that have never been played before on the radio, that hopefully will connect with someone somewhere and, and you'll listen to them again and when you hear them released, you'll recognise them and know that you've heard them here first. Hey, quarter of a million listeners are going to be loving this music. Beautiful. I'm that now, well, good morning to all of you, wherever you are. <laughs> 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 thank you so much for coming in. Thank you, thank you, Michael. It's been lovely. Yeah. The music is wonderful. I can't wait for that album. There's a lot of it. Yeah, great. Yes, stand by. Get along to the globe, basically December. Kelly, thank you so much. You're welcome. Thanks for having us. Kelly, mm -hmm. she's a peaceful, isn't she? Um, <coughs> she might be. She might be. <laughs> <laughs> Keith, Keith, both Keiths are so sweating and looking worried. What's going on? <laughs> Big thank you to Keith Williams. Why did you say Dior? What Dior? 
Thank you. I know what it is. I can okay. see it. We know. Um, we know where we are. We know where we come from. Where we are. <laughs> the, the lovely and hugely talented photographer, Karen Bannon. Way. Are you all coming on the eight to the globe? I am definitely going to. Well, be I'd there. love to see you all because it's been such. A, it's been a party in here. And uh, the guy who's going to take over after Ten o'clock news, Mr. Keith Evans. Thank you. Okay, we're going to finish up with something really special. Uh, I think this was number one, wasn't it? It was. It was my first number one. Here we go. Thanks a lot and goodbye. I will see you back here at 2 o'clock with our news. Happy Christmas!